Hi, and welcome to my very first YouTube channel. And since this is my very first video, I thought I should tell you a little bit about what I plan to talk about on this channel. But first, I'll give you some background information. So over the past year and a half, I've been trying to buy a cargo bike, but with little success. Due to the pandemic, cycling has been more popular, and also there have been supply chain issues. In addition, cargo bikes are just getting more popular, so it's been very difficult for me to find and buy one. While I've been looking for a cargo bike, I've been looking on YouTube to see more about cargo bikes, but I can only find two types of videos for the most part. The first are big cycling channels that do a one-off of, can you replace your car with a cargo bike? Lots of these are uh, sponsored as well. The second are bike manufacturers or bike shops doing, here are the latest and greatest cargo bikes for the year. So I thought I should make a YouTube channel that fills this void that talks more about the long-term ownership of a cargo bike and what it's like to actually try and do lots of different types of errands with a cargo bike. So why should anyone listen to my opinion on cargo bikes? Well, I've been cycling for a really long time. I have almost never had a job, actually I haven't had a job, where I had to drive to work every day. Mostly I've been riding my bike or taking public transit. I've also raced bikes, although not very well. This means I do about 2,000 to maybe even up to 4,000 kilometers of riding a bike per year. I've also been involved in cycling advocacy. I go to city meetings and I look at proposed bike lanes, bike routes, and give my opinion um, and try and encourage more people in my city to use active transportation to get around. The second reason is that I have a PhD in human geography and urban planning. During my PhD, I read about on the concepts of mobility and social exclusion. From mobility, I've read a lot about car culture and alternative transportation. I've also read quite a bit on how cities have developed, at least in North America, since World War II, and why they're so car dependent. And the problem with the city being very car dependent is people who cannot or will not drive might be excluded from society, and that's where social exclusion comes in. And as someone with a disability, I'm quite interested in how people may be excluded from society if they're not able to get around their city. So that's my intention for this channel. I want to show what it's like for me to use a cargo bike and run a wide variety of errands. I want to show all the little things that are in my city that nudge me to either ride a bike or take a car. And that's why the name of this channel is called Bike Bike Nudge Nudge. Now, before you go rushing to the comments and say, that's not a cargo bike, that's a Brompton. I'm well aware. I haven't received my cargo bike yet. It's supposed to come in the next few days. Also, Bromptons are really popular on YouTube, so I want to hashtag this with Brompton so I can maybe trick a few more people into watching this channel. In addition, I might do a few videos just on more urban planning kind of issues, and the Brompton might make an, an appearance. So, if you think what I'm going to talk about in this YouTube channel might be interesting, please consider liking this video and subscribing. Thank you.